everyone? It's your girl Shay here and I'm back with another video for you guys. And this time I'm doing something a little bit different and that is a unboxing. I almost dropped the box. <laughs> an unboxing. This time it's actually I'm unboxing the brand new iPhone 10 XS Max. And I got it in gold and I got it in 256 gigabytes because my current phone is a iPhone 7 Plus and I believe also I think it's 128. It's not even fully full yet, which is why I went with the 256. But let's open this up so I can show you guys what it looks like, so I can also set it up. So let's get started. I'm so excited about this. I have a little pocket knife too, so I can open up the box. Let's get started. Open this up. I should make that a song, huh? Just open it up. Song. Here it is right here, iPhone 10 XS Max in gold, 256 gigs, you guys can see it, 256 gigabytes in gold because my current phone is black but I realized I like the color of gold ones more, so like silver or gold, this one went with gold because it's been a long time, box opening here. Get your usual stuff, stuff that comes with it. The phone. And then of course she comes with the charger block, headphones, the wired ones, not the AirPods. And of course, you always need one charger cable. Although I have a two meter one because I like it to stretch to my bed. But this is the iPhone Tennis Max in gold. Oh, you can see my camera reflected. <laughs> in gold. I had to get this in gold. I am so excited for this. Taking off the plastic. I also have a case for it, so don't worry, I haven't put it in the case yet. Oh, that's just such a beautiful phone. So beautiful. Now I'm gonna turn it on. <gasps> it's on! I am so excited for this phone. You guys have absolutely no idea because I have been waiting for this phone to come in the mail for like since they told me that it was on its way which was like sometime last week but I'm so excited that I finally have it it's basically the same size as my 7 plus pretty much it just has a just an entire display so now I'm gonna set this up and I'll be right back with you guys as soon as I finish setting up this phone. Alright you guys, so I'm back and now my phone is almost set up. Right now it's downloading the iCloud backup, but here's what it looks like again and that's just me and my boyfriend and then this is my current lock screen right here. Now if you see the red light, that's the infrared light, so don't be thinking it's like no like they're gonna come get me or whatever. And just use a space ID to unlock it and it's so quick. Like I'm so in love with this phone. Right now it's just trying to download all my apps again from iCloud so I have to wait on that but otherwise I'm so excited for the phone and I'm going to put on the case now to show you guys. Now where is the case? Oh it's right in front of me. <laughs> now I'm going to put on the case so that I can show you guys. I got the case from Apple. It's just like the pink sand case. And I'm sorry if you're hearing a whole bunch of rustling that's from the packaging but here's a better thing about the case it's just like a silicone case it's in the color pink sand and I had to get pink because pink is my favorite color so I had to get it and this is what it's gonna look like on the phone and here it is that's what it looks like on the phone you can't really tell the color because the case is on it but it is still really really cute and I'm gonna put my pop socket on there also because I'm probably gonna need it and pop socket is on oops just took it off <laughs> it like detached itself 
It's still sticky, but it just won't stick onto the back of this. I guess I'm going to need another case. I just gotta be careful about how I put this on there. So, note to the wise, if you have a, a, a pop socket and try to put on an Apple silicone case, it doesn't exactly sit, sit on there very well. It keeps popping off. And it's not because this is no longer sticky because it was just sticking onto my other phone. So, it's fine. It's about roughly the same size as my 7 Plus, so it's not like a size difference, at least for me. It's just more like you see more of a screen compared to the 7 Plus, which even though mine's black, you don't really see it, but yeah, bigger screen on this one compared to the two. But yeah, I am so excited for this phone. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, like always, and if you guys like, I can do a what's on my iPhone video for you guys so you can see all the apps that I have and stuff like that, and how my setup is on my phone also, and yeah, let me know if you guys want to see that, comment it down below, I've actually always been interested in wanting to do one, so kind of whether or not you guys want it, I might still do it because I've always wanted to do a what's on my iPhone video, but yeah, like always you guys, please subscribe if you haven't already. I make new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday, so this will be my Wednesday video. I know I said it's going to be an anime review, but I'm going to save that one till Saturday, probably. And yeah, so be sure to subscribe. Like always, you guys, stay nerdy, and also, of course, stay positive. And I'll actually link down below all my social media accounts, my Instagram, my Twitter, and my blog as well, so check me out on there, you guys. Alright, you guys.